community. So we're here to support the community of Malcolm, and not just the residents here, but over the over 45 community groups that have sprung up all around the country to confront Quadrilla and to stop other drilling companies from coming into their villages and into their towns. Fracking is going to industrialise England. There's a whole there's the English countryside. There's 64 percent of England is up for fracking concessions. We can see rigs like the one just down the road, 15 minutes away from here, all over the country. And communities are at the forefront of the struggle to, to stop this. We wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the people of Baltham saying no to Quadrilla and organising a camp and protests and petitions and, and all the hard work they've been doing. So that's the second thing. The third thing is conditions. We are creating the conditions here through this camp, through our actions, through everything you've seen here, how you can build a village, through consensus decision making in so many different working groups of legal, medics, kitchens, tranquility, security, well-being, welcome, um, media, and, and everybody here taking part in building this and making it sustainable. So we are, we are creating the conditions here for a movement we are movement building. The media out there are absolutely obsessed with direct action. That's all they want to hear about. We're also about movement building. We want to be sustainable because you can't have the mass collective direct action that they're so afraid of without people supporting each other, trusting each other, coming together and working together as we are here. So that's something we should be really proud of. Yeah. 